What up, y'all? Julian Gatell here. Super thankful because today we're on Chilling with Julian, episode three at Smash Studios, interviewing inspiring individuals to inspire others. We have our lovely guest, musician Marley. Let's go. Hey guys, it's me, Marley. You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter at Marley Sings, and Facebook at Marley Sings. We are here, episode three, Chilling with Julian. Thank you so much for having me. Marley, thank you for coming on. Thank you oh so my gosh. much for having me. We made me. it. We're here. <laughs> yes. To give our viewers a little backstory on how we met, um, mm -hmm. walking home, and I saw you singing, and you were with a violinist. Yeah. Um, his name is Miles, killing it. Both of you guys, I'm like, wait, hold up. I stopped, filmed you guys, and I couldn't pass the opportunity to have you on episode three, so yeah. thank you for coming out. Thank you. I'm so happy to be here, and I love what you're doing. I appreciate I, that. I checked out your Instagram, and I love what you're doing and interviewing inspiring singers and you know a lot of talent for new york so i appreciate I that. Love that thank you and same with miles shout out miles um yeah, super dope miles violin. that's we, my guy right there we gotta get him on uh pretty soon but yeah. let's get right into it yes let's do this so uh who were your musical influences like growing, growing up. up growing up i was listening to a lot of pop music just like i am now mm -hmm. <laughs> um Pink, Nelly Furtado, okay. Alicia Keys. Legends. Yeah, Amy Winehouse. Why those artists? Nina Simone, The Supremes. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Alicia Keys, Nelly Furtado, Pink, they're all pop, mm. but they have like soul. Mm. And maybe I'm missing some, you know, Lady Gaga as well. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I just love the way they are, you know, and especially Alicia Keys. Mm -hmm. And Lady Gaga, you yeah. know, they're both from New York. Um, any artists that you see yourself collaborating with in the future or you would want to? Like a future? big artist? Anybody. <laughs> uh, male artist? I would have to say The Weeknd. Okay. I love The Weeknd. How come? Uh, you know why I love The Weeknd? And Sam Smith, I would okay. love to. I love songs about heartbreak. Mm. Sad songs. Mm -hmm. I love that mm -hmm. so much. Mm -hmm. So I'm, I'm, I'm waiting. I'm, I'm waiting. Yeah. I'm waiting for the weekend to drop an album because he's been very quiet. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I just, I just love songs that mm -hmm. are all about emotion and can be very relatable. Mm -hmm. Strong emotions. Yeah. Happy songs are great. Mm -hmm. I, that's what I'm listening to mm -hmm. right now because yeah. you know it's summertime. Yeah. Um, but the sad, the sad songs really got mm -hmm. to me. And you, you really connect with your audience when you're listening to that too as well. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh definitely. So those are two artists that I would love to collaborate with. Okay. Um, are you working on any of your own? Yeah, I am. Exciting, <laughs> exciting. I am um, very excited. I think it's time mm -hmm. to bring something out very soon. Mm -hmm. And everyone's been waiting for that. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, people know me, you know, for doing covers at mm -hmm. the subway, but I think it's time for people to get to know me more. Mm -hmm. You know, I write my own music and wow. I also collaborate okay. with other artists writing as well. Mm -hmm. But I do love writing my own music because mm -hmm. it comes from in here. Yeah. <laughs> and especially, you know, going through things mm -hmm. and, you know, everyone goes through heartbreak yeah. and emotions mm -hmm. and sadness. And yeah. I feel like that helps me so much. Mm. Whenever I go through a hard moment, mm -hmm. that's when I create music. Mm. When I'm happy, yeah. I don't write. Mm. It's so crazy. Yeah, because you have more to talk about at the end yeah. of the day. Yeah, like right now I'm waiting. I, I, I want <laughs> it's like yeah. I want to get sad right yeah. now mm -hmm. to write uh, like five, six, seven more songs. Yeah. When you think about <laughs> uh, go back to um, Usher. Mm. There was a point in time where he had a lot of heartbreak and then that album just skyrocketed. Yeah. So um, definitely see where you're coming from with that. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, if you can go back, what advice would you give to younger Marley? Mm. The advice I would give to younger Marley would be not to overthink or think about what people have to say about you. Because mm -hmm. I used to overthink a lot. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I still do. Mm -hmm. But... I don't really care what people have to say. Mm. You know, everyone has their own opinion. Mm -hmm. So that's, you know, 
Just yeah. don't pay mind and yeah. just focus on yourself. That's good advice. Mm -hmm. Especially um, because when you think about it, when you overthink and you're con constantly, as a, as a musician or a creative or artist, um, it could get tough because at the end of the day, you're always putting your work out there, you're always mm -hmm. putting yourself out there. And there's gonna be comments, there's gonna be people talking. Mm -hmm. And if you continue to just be yourself and not worry about that, yeah. the naysayers or the chatter, Exactly. You just continue being you and yeah. stick with your supporters. And also, you know, also not to please everyone because mm. you can't do that. 100%. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. one thing I learned. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. awesome. Mm -hmm. um, so, what is your creative process? Hmm, my creative process, it all depends on the way I'm feeling. Mm -hmm. You know, um, songwriters, they like to sit down mm -hmm. and plan. Mm -hmm on writing the song. Mm -hmm. I don't really like doing that. Mm -hmm. I just let the inspiration come to me. Okay. I'm going through something. Mm -hmm. You know, recently I went through something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. And that really inspired me mm -hmm. to write. And yeah. uh, that just gives me so much joy. Yeah. When I go through pain and I can write about something. Mm -hmm. I know it sounds weird. Yeah. But that makes me happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's my creative process. Mm -hmm. I just let the inspiration come to me. Yeah. And when I'm on the train, mm -hmm. I get inspired. Mm -hmm. Like I, I can come up with melodies and lyrics. Okay. Easily, but I also sometimes plan. Okay. You know, on when to write a so write a song. Yeah. yeah. That's amazing. Does traveling help too? Like being in different places. Traveling. You get inspired um, by just different places. I think people really inspire me. Okay, people. So. I want to do more traveling. Mm -hmm. but I feel like that's gonna bring a lot more to my music. Mm. Mm -hmm. That's amazing. Mm -hmm. All right. So, what message would you give to your fans? Hmm. The me like, what kind of message? Any message? Um, any message uh, to the people that support you, the people that been mm -hmm. there since day one, mm -hmm. um, to know about you uh, or remember about you. Well, I feel like my supporters are have gotten to know me more especially through subway performing mm -hmm. um but one thing i can say is that i just want to thank them so much because mm -hmm. they've been here from the beginning mm -hmm. i started subway performing like three years ago mm -hmm. and they're still here they're still waiting for my original music yeah so they're very patient mm -hmm. and i i think that's that's a lot of loyalty right there mm -hmm. <laughs> and that feels good when you have somebody from square one and then just continue to support yeah. that i'm you, surprised yeah. that they're still here <laughs> don't be surprised you're uh super dope and at yeah. the end of the day when they they get find something mm -hmm. that's just authentic mm -hmm. it just goes from there yeah. yeah it's true so i love you guys shout out <laughs> so we have a speed round uh you got 60 seconds to answer these oh gosh questions. i'm under pressure <laughs> um so let's begin Favorite season? Summer. Favorite month? Mm, July. Favorite sports team? Oh, Yankees, but I don't want Favorite them. holiday? <laughs> what? Favorite holiday? Uh, Christmas, uh, New Year. Favorite day of the week? Uh, Thursday. Uh, favorite color? Mm, emerald green. Favorite city? New York. Uh, what are you binge watching right now? <laughs> uh, I was watching Power. Power, uh, Power, Power. Singing, dancing, or both? Singing. Hey, uh, <laughs> early bird or night owl? Night owl. Favorite cartoon? Mm, most shows on Cartoon Network. Uh, and your favorite food? Dominican food. Hey, shout out Dominican food. <laughs> I think you got it. I, yeah. The timer, we got to check that, but uh, I think you got it. Yay! But, that, was, that, was, that was my first speed round. Ooh, first speed round with Marley. Yeah, I'm hey. still getting used to this. Yeah. But that was fun. That was really fun. <laughs> you're going to have more because you're going this way. Yeah. So, um... I want to thank you primarily because mm -hmm. being an artist and you're putting yourself out there and you're going to different places mm -hmm. and to have these opportunities come in um, yeah. I'm thankful to to speak with you mm -hmm. and just learn about you and have the viewers learn about you um, super dope so I yeah. thank you for coming on thank you so much 100%. I love being here it was just a cool vibe and mm -hmm chill just, yeah. just like your show chilling with julian i appreciate that yeah <laughs> uh, so man. i can't wait i can't wait but i want to thank you again and uh 
our viewers know on Chilling with Julian, we have a second segment mm -hmm. where you just share uh, a little bit of your art. Um, you can sing for us today. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Sounds yeah. good. Okay. Thank you, all guys, for tuning in to Chilling with Julian. Um, episode three, we have Marley going to share what she got. Marley, take it away. All right, so this is uh, one of my favorite covers. I, I mean, uh, songs. Uh, Diana Washington, What a Difference a Day Made. What a difference a day made. 24 little hours brought the sun and the flowers. Oh, where they used to be rain. My yesterday was blue, dear. Today I'm a part of you, dear. My lonely nights are through, dear. Since you said you were mine. Oh, what a difference a day made. There's a rainbow before me. And that's just a little part of the song. Wow. Yeah. That was amazing. Thanks. Thank you again. Yeah. I appreciate you coming on to this show. Um, Viewers will definitely get uh, learn a little bit more about you. Mm -hmm. yeah, and at the end of the day, um, creatives support creatives, and mm -hmm. uh, got my support 100%. Thank you, and I can't wait. Maybe I'll come, I'll come back here, and I'll, I'll share, I'll share my new music updates. Ooh.